Today we're going to talk about cervical cancer. Well, cervical cancer is primarily caused by an infection with the human papilloma virus, or what we call HPV, which is the main risk factor. So, primary prevention of this cancer involves vaccination against the most frequent applicated HPV types, particularly HPV 16 and 18, which are responsible for the majority of cervical cancer cases. The natural history of cervical cancer is characterized by a long period between the initial cellular transformation and the development of an invasive carcinoma or cancer, averaging around 30 years, though it can range from 10 to 15 years. This prolonged transformation period provides a window of opportunity for early screening, making this cancer particularly accessible to secondary prevention. The pap smear or a cervical cytology test is the most commonly used screening tool, allowing for the detection of cellular abnormalities before they develop into an invasive cancer. This enables preventive interventions to stop cancer progression. Screening also includes HPV genotyping tests and clinical examinations, which help identify early lesions that can be treated before they evolve. When it comes to a positive diagnosis of cervical cancer, it's based on a clinical signs, a physical examination, and endoscopic tests, such as colposcopy, and of course, histological tests. The treatment of a cervical cancer mainly relies on surgery, with a procedures such as colonization or hysterectomy, depending on the stage of the disease and the patient's condition. Based on the diagnosis results, additional treatments such as radiotherapy and chemotherapy may be considered. When it comes to prognosis, it is largely depends on the early detection of the disease. The earlier the cancer is diagnosed, the better the prognosis is, emphasizing the importance of regular screening and the early identification of precancerous lesions. We will talk about the positive diagnosis, clinical symptoms, and other stuff in the next videos. Thank you so much for watching till the end, and I'll see you in the next one. And don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you.